What's going on YouTube? I'm looking at the camera wrong. <laughs> um, okay, today I'm doing a video of an update of a pair of shoes I bought a few weeks ago. I'm kind of disappointed, but maybe if I could explain it the best way why I'm returning these to Nike. Um, maybe you can understand where I'm coming from, if that makes any sense. So I'm gonna reverse the cameras and show you what I got, okay? If I do it right, no. All right, here we go. Yes, I bought the Air 270s. And uh, as you can see, they're clean. I only had them for like a couple weeks. And uh, I'm really upset right now. Um, I bought the shoes to wear daily. That's including work. And um, a couple days ago, I was walking to the cafeteria at my job and my foot rubbed up against like the metal base, like something like this to, you know, the chairs there. And um, didn't think nothing about it. So um, the next day I caught myself cleaning my shoes, you know, and I noticed that there was this uh, line. So I'm thinking, you know, well, it's nothing. It's probably just a, a mark. Well, come to find out whatever it was that I walked into, cut it straight through. Well, I ain't going to say straight through. It, it put a nice gash. I mean, my fingernail is, is uh, not that much longer, but I could stick my whole fingernail in there and I could, and there's still room to push further inside um as you can see the the air pockets they hold up but this composite foam i guess that's what they call it the foam design they have i think that kind of sucks because um it's easy to damage this i mean it's not like i did it on purpose it's not like i took a razor or anything but you know it's, it's just easy to puncture and even on the the left side the left foot same thing um, so I guess when you buy these, it is very easy to rupture the foam part. The rest of the shoe can hold up, but for $150, um, I'm not saying it's a lot of money, but it is when you really think about, um, you know, shoes, uh, cause like, I don't care what people say. Shoes do cost a lot, but um, it is an investment uh, because your feet are what you're going to be walking on all day. And for something to pay $150 for and it tears up that easy, um, I'm not really happy with it. But um, I guess I'm ta I talked to Nike and um, they were supposed to be sending out something so I can send the shoes back so they could look it over. But... Um, the shoes, don't get me wrong, the shoes are comfortable and they they do walk, you can walk in them all day. But keep in mind that you have to be like careful with these because something like that can happen and that can mess up your shoes. Now, I have shoes, I bought Nikes, I have pretty much a lot of Nike shoes that I had for years. And I know I've rubbed up against a lot of metal base, you know, whether it's stands or chairs or whatever. But I never had something to da get damaged that easy. And um, I think that's uh, something people ought to be aware of when you decide to spend that kind of money on some shoes with this kind of material. Um, I think they should change that material, make it more uh, durable, or do something to protect this so that, you know, you're going to get scuffs on the shoes, of course. But something like this, that's, that's way too easy. So... Um, I'm going to probably do an updated video on what happens once I send these shoes in. I'll probably send them back tomorrow because they're supposed to send me a return shipment label for it. So, um, you know, uh, like I say, if you want a review of this shoe, i tell you what right now. I, I hate to send them back because they are nice shoes. I like the way how they fit and everything. I just don't like the way how that turned out. And I think that's... One, it's, a, it's a cool design, but I think it's a poor product that they use for it. Um, so, uh, 
leave me some of your comments. Um, give me a thumbs up. Hit smash the, the like button. You know, subscribe because I'm going to be doing a lot more videos on some twos. So thank you. And uh, you guys have a good evening. And, and if you own a pair of these shoes, share me your thoughts on, you know, about your shoes and have you came across the same issues? Because like I said, I've seen a lot of videos on these shoes and that's what made me decide to buy them. Um, but I've never seen any videos where it shows this kind of damage. So like I say, um, share me your thoughts, leave a comment. Have a good one, okay? Take it easy.